Domestic drinking water. How does the Missouri Department of Natural Resources protect this great natural resource? More than 150,000 domestic wells are used to supply drinking water to as many as a half a million Missourians. We are fortunate that in the majority of the state, we have an ample supply of naturally cold, clear, and clean water for drinking and domestic purposes. The department supports the reasonable and safe use of this resource by employing staff to ensure groundwater supplies are protected today and tomorrow. We accomplish this by ensuring wells are constructed to prevent surface contaminants that may come from domestic wastewater, livestock, accidental spills, or other sources from entering drinking water aquifers. During the last 23 years, the department has been committed to protecting groundwater through better well construction standards. A good understanding of important geological formations and groundwater sources is essential so that wells can be constructed to take advantage of rock layers that naturally protect usable aquifers. As can be seen in this diagram, proper casing and sealant is installed to a depth that prevents surface water and shallow groundwater from entering the deeper water supply. This is important to protect all users of this resource now and for the future. One of the tools we use to investigate wells that may have construction problems is called a downhole camera. This device is no more than a small waterproof video camera with a light source. The camera is attached to several hundred feet of cable. The cable is connected to a monitor with video recording capabilities. The camera is slowly lowered down the well to give us an inside look. As we take a look at this first video, we see the steel casing appears to be reasonably intact, but it has significant corrosion. The 600-foot deep well was constructed as an irrigation well, but has not been in operation for several years. The owner, a farmer, needed additional water and hired a well driller to deepen this well in an attempt to increase the yield. Because the farmer had no information about the well, and the driller was concerned about working on a well without knowing more about the well's integrity, he contacted us to examine the casing with our downhole camera. Rusting and deterioration has caused a breach in the casing at a depth of approximately 40 feet. As a result, shallow groundwater that may contain harmful contaminants is cascading down this well bore to the deeper drinking water source several hundred feet below. We discovered the well had structural damage and corrections needed to be made. State law dictates that the well would have to be reconstructed to meet the farmer's water needs, or taken out of service and permanently plugged. Following this investigation, the farmer decided to deepen the well to approximately 850 feet, and a liner was installed inside the casing to seal the leak and prevent contamination of the lower aquifer. This video was taken of a well constructed to state standards that served two mobile homes. The owner had rented the home to tenants he eventually had to evict. After the tenants left, the owner discovered the well pump had been removed and there was concern that the well may have been vandalized. The owner requested our assistance to examine the well. The video begins by showing the PVC casing which appears to be in good condition. As we move further down to a depth of approximately 28 feet, the camera reveals a blockage consisting of pieces of broken cinder block, bricks, and rocks. Attempts to remove the material were unsuccessful and the well had to be plugged. The groundwater contamination problem was solved, but the owner will have to drill a new well to supply the residents. You have just seen two examples of how the Missouri Department of Natural Resources protects domestic drinking water supplies. If you own a private well and have concerns or questions, please contact the Missouri Department of Natural Resources Division of Geology and Land Survey.